Haven't you heard? Welcome everybody. We're gonna continue the pestilence. We're just gonna continue the main story, okay? As I don't have much time to play this session. It's okay though. Let's get in as many as we can. Sure. What? Never caught any ghosts? Just throw it! The hell with him? I didn't sign up for this. The hell? Now, what do you think you're doing here? Our mentor sent us to this castle and provided this magic cage. We are to catch a rampaging elemental. Don't be silly. This is no simple elemental, but a primordial spirit. It summoned its own horde of lesser spirits for minions. It's mighty powerful. And this dunderhead left the cage way over there. Looks like Gazella was right about my needing to intervene. Really? That's great news. If you could clear a path for us, we'll sneak up to the cage and capture the spirit. What are you waiting for? Go ahead and attack them. Oh, God. I don't even know if this is a good fight. We're gonna be very, oh God, we're gonna be very one-sided. <laughs> Ooh, we gotta go first. Okay. First confusion in everyone. It's gonna be huge. Let's do that. We gotta get rid of the ice elementals. Didn't crit. Damn. Oh, that is why we gotta get rid of the ice elemental. is down because of the ice right out increase resistance okay they still have confusion on them initiative debuff Range unit damage decrease is pretty good. Minimum damage is pretty good. Damage vulnerability. Power up allies. That's a pretty bad choice to use fire on fire. <gasps> Ooh. Yep, let's do this. Perfect. That's exactly what I was hoping. All right. Let's 
hit that. Move. Hit that. Defend. Perfect. Yes, kill the ghouls. They're bad. You can't move anywhere that can attack, so kill that. Didn't kill. Okay. One thousand. Not terrible. Shh, be quiet. It's like a Pokeball. I told you, didn't I? The elemental has been trapped. We need to go see Sequester now. The cage is yours now. I'm sure you can manage from now on. Bring the cage to Sequester's lab. He'll put it on a mana booster so it won't run out of power and... Come on, they're not stupid. They'll figure it out. As for us, we're going to celebrate at the Goose and Logos. Is uh, this go. what magic is coming to? Right. There's nothing left to do here. Hey. Magic cage. Isn't all that special? Oh. Right. Not enough. Okay. Not enough here either. We're about to get more magic power. That's good. And then soon we will get supreme magic. Casting magic. Three times in a single combat round. Don't be insane. So that's to continue for oh, oh yeah. okay.
75? That's nothing on this level. What the heck? Seriously? Literally nothing in this level. Oh, that's this camp right That's what I need. Has come at last. I think I've seen you somewhere before. Are you the one who wrote these letters? Yes, twas I. Once I was known as Count Wilmore, Keeper of the Royal Seal and Lord of Castle Arden. Like many other loyal servants of the King, I was a victim of slander. My enemies had me imprisoned in my own castle. I've been looking for a way out for ten long years. During that time, I learned to tame the rats. The only creatures that can come and go at will. You found one such messenger. I believe its name was Armin. You look much older than when I last saw you, Count. Am I the first one to respond to your pleas? How selfish people are. When I came for justice and later for pity, none came. But as soon as I mentioned filthy lucre, all the cellar contains is a couple bottles of wine and some moldy cheese. Gold is not there. I do have some treasures stashed away, though. I'm willing to part with one such cash. Sky, fresh air. Oh, I feel dizzy. All these years I have waited. Free at last. But this isn't the end of it. Not yet. They'll pay. They what are you going to do now? Will you ask Gazella for help? I take it she's a relation of yours. Don't speak that wretched woman's name in my presence. Gazella is my niece. Indeed, the castle is hers now. No one can be trusted. No one at all. teleport up here.
picked up a plague mask from Remedius yet. I am Thor, you. No, I demand. How delightful. Now that you've caught the spirit, life at Castle Arden can start anew. Members of the nobility should watch out for each other. Dearest Sequester, do tell. What awaits the captured spirit? Apparently, this spirit used to work at the Mage Factory. We don't know its true name, and therefore, I suppose we'll trap it in underground storage. There will be an investigation, followed by a trial before the magical court of law. Do you really find these details interesting? It's a long story, one that will last a few years at minimum. Delightful. Well, now I must go. I'll be sure to tell Councillor Montier how promptly the mages rushed to assist me. Naturally. I'll put in a word about your invaluable assistance as well. Dang. I bind you with your true name, Ador. Now answer me. I am here. Command and I will obey. The night you were unchained, did you witness a ritual performed at the Mage Factory? What happened there? No. I do not want to go back. But I will. I will speak. Elio's child, hear me. I saw them come from all over the earth. Lost ones seeking unity in the void. They called to it. Their souls reached out for the void. And the void answered. One of them was chosen and touched. And so it came to our world. The spell was lifted. My shackles fell to the ground and I ran away. The blight. I was looking for salvation. Go on. I want to know more. No. 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 I do not want. I will not. Fear. Void. The blight in the void. This has got to be the I worst voice acting not. so far in this game. I will not. There were many there like you, before their souls were extinguished. I saw them, one, another, and another, many there were. I witnessed the battle after I escaped. The mage factor woke the golems. He fought off the blight and saved many, and led them under the mountain. So there were survivors. I see not through stone. The mage factor took them under the mountains. That is where they hid. The hole they went through was guarded by golems. They fought well, and the battle stopped. The wind carried their whispers to me. They prayed for salvation. They wept, and then, void, horrifying, I do not want, I will not, mercy, do not make me see them, child of Eliu. So be it. Thank you, Ador. You may rest now. Void, the blight. It's a shame we met for but a fleeting moment, like a lightning flash in the night. I hope we will meet again under easier circumstances. What? There's another battle there?
the hell? Why are there soldiers here now? Step. Shoot the shit out of the room. Destroy those mages. Go, go. Oof. Okay, move here, shoot the other archers. Now we need another group of So why was there another fight? That was weird. By the Archmage's decree, entrance to the Mage Factory is prohibited. Turn back. Anything else? I'm not opening the gate. The Mage Factory is closed. I'm conducting an investigation on the Prince's behalf. Has there been any news from inside? They paid me a heap of gold to guard this outpost, and a second heap to keep my mouth shut. 
I don't care if the prince or the king or the creator himself sent you. There's nothing for you here. Call the overseer. But why can't we just kill him? <laughs> I always question games that do this. But why can't we just kill him? We're walking around with literally 54 like units, army, combatants. He's one man and two golem. Uh, uh, makes no sense. Leia is pretty dumb. It's pretty dumb. How have I never seen this girl out of all of my time walking away? Ooh, eight. Try to save up for supreme magic. By the oh. way, do you know anything about ba Fate has smiled upon me twice, and both times through you, my friend. You look well, Count. Reconnecting with old acquaintances. Just so. There's one connection I need to restore in particular, and I'll need your help. What if I offer to pay you to partake in a sort of private battle? I've been mistaken for a mercenary much too often lately. Even by other counts. What battle? It is about my vengeance. I want revenge, and I'm almost prepared to get it. I shall make Baron Gladrin pay for slandering my good name. However, I need experienced warriors, and someone like you. Where will this battle take place? I challenged Gladrin to combat on the fields under the aqueduct. I'll await you there. I wonder what our villain Gladrin has to say about this. Loyal subjects of the king, in the name of his royal majesty, king Damn immigrants. We replaced the crystal, but the mana's draining away. What are we doing wrong? I'm glad to see you. Have you heard? Count Wilmore is back in the capital. I've seen him. So, you already know then. That monster has challenged me to a battle in the suburbs. Is he that bad? He's a deceitful snake who's been coiled around the throne for years. He's the royal treasurer. And Nostria's top thief. Every treasure he stashed away is soaked in the blood of those he's robbed or killed. My father, too, suffered at that wicked beast's hands. He didn't even spare his own sister, Baroness d'Arden, or her husband. How long did he hold their daughter, Gisela, captive in a cellar? He never told me any of that. So you had a reason to punish him? Yes. It took all the strength I possessed to seal him in that cellar. But it was nevertheless a mistake. I should have killed him. We replaced hey. the crystal, but the man is draining away. Hmm. 
Subjects of the king, in the name of his royal majesty. What do we know about the preparations for the expedition to Monpatri, Count? You promised to come to a decision any day. Your Highness, the Archmage is standing his ground. I tried. Ah, finally! So what happened at the Mage Factory? Did you determine the cause? Allow me, Your Highness. Do you distrust the Royal Council? Your father never. My dear Count, sometimes one opinion is not enough. Well, what did you find out? You've been misled. The cause of the Monpatri disaster was a magical ritual performed by an unknown cult. Apparently, they were your subjects. The majority of them likely perished during the ritual itself. Do you have a witness or some proof to support this account? I have plenty of witnesses. One of them a captive elemental spirit called Ador. Such an entity is incapable of lying, as you know. By the by, Ador saw the last people fleeing the Mage Factory hide in the mine. But since you cannot send a rescue mission... We must delay no longer. I entrust you with rescuing the survivors. Go to Monpatri, extricate my subjects, and bring them to me. Your Highness, the Mage Factory is quarantined by order of the Archmage Kaythor, as I told you. Since when does the Prince of Nostria bend the knee to an Archmage? Adrian? You promised to set me free. Our agreement stands. But so far, all you have provided me are words. Words that cast suspicion upon the Royal Council as well as the Royal Order of Mages. Centuries old pillars supporting the throne. Prove your suspicions with something substantial. Find the survivors and bring them to the Citadel. Do this, and if all is as you say, I will grant you the pardon you were promised. How do you like my decision, Count? I think that's how we're going to expose the truth. Unthinkable! Anything else? I'd like to obtain a document I could present to confirm my authority at the outposts near the Mage Factory. I cannot help you with that. Ever since the days of Maximus, Archmages have recognized no authority but the King. If Kaythorn has decided to quarantine the Mage Factory, neither I nor the Royal Council are in a position to reverse his decision. In order to get through the quarantine, you need a document carrying the King's personal seal. My father is recovering, but... Are you joking, my Prince? You're sending me on an impossible errand. If Kaythorn has decided to quarantine the Mage Factory, neither I nor the Royal Council have the authority to reverse his decision. But please, exercise some discretion. We don't want a conflict with the Archmage right now. You have your task. What else do you want? Sage advice from one of the King's wisest counselors? Surely you realize the Prince is asking the impossible. There's no getting into the Mage Factory, and that, I'm afraid, is the end of it. I've been sending off letters to the Archmage for days. How many replies do you suppose I've received? The Royal Council is powerless here, and there are no legal ways into the Mage Factory. Although, perhaps you could interrogate your precious witnesses. I don't expect they know anything useful, but why not? We're done here. Unless my eyes deceive me, my outstanding friend, I can literally see those masked villains prepare- Make haste, stop them! What's important to me is my freedom, Montier. If I must play the sleuth for the sake of it, then so be it. 
The Royal Council is certain that your efforts will help us bring about order, resolve discord, and establish unity in Nostria. Subjects of the King, in the name of His Royal Majesty, King Mm. Yeah, the walking around part is the worst part of this game. Torch isn't even that much faster. Uh. Count Wilmar, you're a thief, a murderer, and an embezzler of the Crown's funds. Prepare to die. You'll answer for that, maggot. Warriors, two arms. Hired a gang of assassins, have you? I'm prepared for your dirty tricks. Squad, to me! Don't just stand there, I need your help. I'm the one paying you. Couldn't you wait for me, gentlemen? Look at the blackguard. Courtly schemer. His hands are soaked in blood. My friend, join the fray and you'll know my generosity. It's time for a tough decision, as ever. Get up, Count Wilmore. You and I are nobility. We should stand together. My personal savior. And right on time, too. Well then. So much the worse for you both. I fight for truth and the crown. Prepare for battle! I'm ready. Shall we? This is a strong enemy. Pathetic. Oh, shit, why are you all over there? Whack. Gonna do a dash and the run. Or not. Confusing. Oh. 
Block the path. Or kill as much archers as possible. Here, go on pure defense. Okay, yeah, we're not gonna resurrect the horse. I don't think we're gonna, okay. and then we're gonna go magic source, buff everybody. Revenge. I have waited for so long. Gladrin, the sissy, accused me of all manner of crimes, while every day I served my old friend Montier faithfully. Did he really believe Montier had nothing to hide from the law? But what does it matter? I appreciate your help. The reward I promised is waiting for you. Fire Emerald Ring. Arcane Knowledge 2. It does boost army, but I really don't care about that. Okay. Could be worse. Could have been worse. Yeah, I think I would have preferred it if it was just a uh, top-down, massive overworld map going? instead of like moving try, through buddy? the world. Like, huh. Just like the you know original series, I think that'll look better. Are you satisfied now? Yes, I am. Whoa. That dude is a mark of everyone. Oh, you're back to ask more questions. But you haven't brought any aid. Norman intends to return to the mage factory and fetch his wife. Pass the quarantine, pass the mages. How? Ah, yes. It's really simple. There's a secret passage neither the mages nor the guards knew about. It leads from the foundry straight to the outside. They call me Bludgeon's underling. But all the master craftsmen had dealings with him and his smugglers. Norman was no exception. Tell me where it is. How do I find it? There's a man named Barry. I can't say anything about it without his okay. I gotta be careful, you see. You can find him in Bludgeon's Den. He can tell you everything. Well, if he chooses to, obviously. Great. Are 
you satisfied uh, now? Yes, I am. That goof has a brilliant mind. He threw out all the sick and chased away the crying women. Merciful cry. Then we've got the highway right nearby. I went to her, and she rejected me alone. Have you seen the way Bonnie looks at Marlene? Ha, you want a piece Whoa. of this? Now there's a mark in her. I've seen one. I've heard you're a marksman among marksmen. So? I told you, there's no more merchandise. The shop's closed. What about a secret passage into the mage factory? What secret passage? I don't know anything about it. I'm a simple merchant purchasing goods in Floster. Folks, does anyone have any idea what this is about? These people from Marcella are asking odd questions. Actually, I'm from Rigern. And you've got Smuggler written all over you. I don't intend to arrest nor inform on you. I simply need to get into the mage factory. Do I look like a fool to you? I don't know you from this. Support me. If someone were to vouch for you, then we could talk. But as it stands, I know nothing about any passage. If you hear about the Mage Factory goods, I'm afraid I can't help you. That's it. The store's closed for good. Check your pockets, Jack and Hicks. You ain't no village simple to You vouch for me. Where is my weapon? No. Vincent is late. I can't wait. I'm taking on worse. Really? We're just gonna end it like that? Really stupid. Okay. No speed checks, anything. Just you fail. Okay. No threatening him, nothing. You just didn't walk away. What else do you want? Surely you can see I have work to do. How do I get past the quarantine and into the mage factory? You must know about any secret passages. Are you kidding? I'm head of the guards. I close down every known passage, though there is the tunnel used by the foundry craftsmen for their side business. If you could find one of them, Norman for example. Did he survive by the way? Yes. He's the leader of the refugees now. Then can we wrap this up? I've still got lots of work to do here. George will skin me alive if I don't finish on time. Leave me alone already. How do you like that wonderful trip? Have 
you picked up a plague mask from Remedius yet? I haven't. Why are you disturbing me? The end times loom before me. I need to get into the mage factory without attracting attention. Do you know how that might be done, Ador? I know what it is to be a prisoner of men. It is so hard for me, a son of the wind, to suffer this confinement. But I also know that stone is closer to me than the approaching terror of the void. I so desire to exist, trapped in this cage if I must be, but not to disappear. Is there anything else you'd like to say? Nothing. been bewitched? I've been waiting for an audience Can't with Major Rasmus for over an hour, and waiting on someone else. At last, my divination proved correct. You showed up after all. Perhaps you should attempt to divine something about that gentleman in the pavilion. For instance, a free space in his schedule. As you can see, He's so busy, he won't even speak to me, the eldest of the mentors. But I do not take offense. The Archmage's will is law. And you're willing to wait. I can see it is a serious matter. I took the opportunity to interrogate Ador. Forgive me, but I couldn't help overhearing his name as you uttered it. Uh, what this spirit has spoken of, the Archmage needs to hear what he knows at once and take action. He could, for example, lift this pointless quarantine. So many spell components wasted. So much mana, so much effort. All for nothing. We've been fighting imaginary enemies. Can you believe it? Of course. I too think the quarantine is pointless, and I urgently need to get past it. Do you know anyone who could help me with that? I've helped you already. I spoke with an old friend, Master Remedius. He is waiting for you at the outpost by the Mage Factory Bridge. He can help you. Just don't tell the Archmage. Let it be a secret between you and me, all right? Why? If I were you, I wouldn't dilly-dally. You should be on your way, full speed, to the outpost by the Mage Factory. Remedius can't wait there forever. Now we can continue using plain speech. Do you understand everything I have told you, Erasmus? Yes, Master. Then act, and be quick about it. It shall be done. However... What is the matter? Is it because of her? You know what happened between us. I'm afraid I won't be able to change her mind. No one else can. But you, at the very least, have a chance. Find the repository. We need those clawed couriers more than enough. I've been waiting for an audience with Mage Erasmus for over an hour. Can't you go around? I still want to do this. My boy wrote to say he started studying the art of brewing elixir. Did you find the retort? Do you have it? Of course not. On to another topic. 
Do you perhaps know of an alternate entrance into the Mage Factory? If only I could remember. That blasted poison. All I know is that the craftsmen of the Foundry were running a business on the side. They occupied some sort of a basement there, or tunnel. I recall someone named Norman. A good fellow, albeit a swindler and a thief. But who among us is better? Oh, forgive me. It hurts to remember. Find the retort as soon as you can, please. Oh, good. Oh my god. Oh my god. Both of those are amazing. My boy wrote to say he started studying the art of brewing the Actually, what are like the really good things? Oh my god. Dude, I can't wait until I play Warfare. Ugh. It's gonna be amazing. Halt! Who goes there? An envoy from Prince Adrian. I need to get into the Mage Factory. Now. Ah, you're from the Prince. We've been waiting on you for a good while now. Waiting for me? Candor will tell you. He's in charge while Remedius is away. Open the gate, you loafers. What? Call the Overseer. The most brazen thief I... First he steals the fence, now he wants to talk to you. <gasps> Ooh! Okay. My goodness, I am so excited for this. Look at that. Can't wait until I work my way down there. It'll be fantastic. Call the overseer. The most brazen thief I. First he scales the fence, now he wants... 